I'm Kit, and this is my hubby, Yere. Focus on the road. In September 21, I bought a camper van, Willy, and began exploring the local woods, farms, rivers, and waterfalls in the nearby counties, and having a few hair-raising adventures along the way. In this special limited season, my hubby Yere finally joins me on the road as I take him on a whistle-stop tour of my favourite van life locations, and together we discover some exciting new places of our own. Please subscribe to stay abreast of our ongoing van life journey. Hello, welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, my name's Kit and this is my hubby, Yere. Hello. And Yere's here for a limited time, uh, so make the most of it. Uh, we've been making the most of it over the last couple of days. We've been doing some outings, we visited some castles and uh, we realised that we hadn't done an intro. So this is the intro and then we'll tell you about where we've been. <laughs> Uh, well, probably just a couple of hours at most. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, yes, please. Would you like a map? Uh, no, it's all right. I've been Thank before. You Thank you. And we started with Newstead Abbey. Mm -hmm. we? Indeed, we did. Now, the reason we chose Newstead is because it's local um, and I wanted to start us somewhere nice and easy and also because it's lovely isn't it? mm -hmm, yeah. and we had a good day. Yeah, we had. So, lots of beautiful gardens up there. So let's show them the map. <laughs> I might cut to a graphic at that point. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, first we went uh, through the Byron's Oak. Do you remember the oak? I don't. Me neither. <laughs> did, we see, did, did we see an oak? Yeah, that's confusing. I don't remember an oak. I have no recollection of that at all. Where did we park? We parked over there. Right. Then we walked in front of the, that, oh, the, yeah. front of the um, Newstead Abbey house. That's the main abbey. And you wanted to get some reference photos mm -hmm. of drain pipes. And yes. Things. Fascinating great pipes and symbols and stuff. And but then we then we looked at the the birds, didn't we? Because you tried to give us both bird flu. Hello. Pretty bird. Are we allowed to touch them? And you made friends with one. Mm -hmm. and gave it bird flu. You wanted to stroke it. Yes, I wanted. But I didn't. So since. Then we went to the Abbey. Yes, then we walked to the Abbey. Then we walked this way. That's where the tour officially should begin. And then headed that way. Well, there's supposed to be an oak, but yeah, I don't remember an oak. I don't remember an oak. That, but that's where all the chi all the people were and the children oh, yeah. were playing. That's the, that big lawn, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Anyway, I do remember we took a look at some statues there. The gargoyles. Gargoyles, yes. Here, yes. yeah, and then there's this place called 
French garden, although it didn't look that French to me. We didn't go in there, though, did we? No, we just looked at the other. Walked right past it. Yeah, looked from the outside. Mum is a gardener, she might be interested. Yeah, there was this nice little, this kind of secluded little pond. That's right, you dived through a gap in the trees mm -hmm. and took me on a perilous path down a mm -hmm. muddy slope towards mm -hmm. a stagnant pond mm -hmm. where I was eaten alive by mosquitoes and you looked at some ducks. Yes, there were some lovely ducks at the stew pond. Left up the stairs. Mm -hmm. Oh, you want to go down there? <laughs> no, I don't want to go down there. I want to take a picture of this. It's very enticing. Yeah, very, very nice corridor. Yes. This is what it's supposed to be like. I'm having the time of my life. We went through that little gate. That's the tunnel. The tunnel of love. Ah, yes, the tunnel of love. Swains or Bo Bosons, whatever, whatever his name is. Yes, in my earlier video, I called him Boatswain because that's how it's spelled phonetically. And I'm an idiot because it's pronounced Boson, and I should know that because I'm a fan of all things nautical. So the word Boatswain is pronounced Boson, and it's a job on a boat. Hmm. Well, me as a foreigner, I, I guess I. I'm allowed to say both swing. You can say whatever you like. As a foreigner, <laughs> you speak better English than me anyway. Yere has a master's in English. <laughs> but that's I'm the not, cleverest person I've ever met in my life. Nothing to brag about. Yere reads Tolstoy. Anyone who doesn't know Yere, um, I should probably introduce him. He's not just my hubby, he's also an eminent booktuber. He's renowned the world over. People have interviewed him. Famous celebrity booktubers have interviewed Yere because he's an authority on all things book related, aren't you? Apparently I am. <laughs> <laughs> Take my word for it. He's a very clever man. Anyway, carry on. So there's uh, the Great Garden, which was quite surprising in the sense that there wasn't that many people. There were two statues. There was a nymph and... Or a fawn? A f well, I thought it was a fawn and you thought it was a satyr, and we never really found out well, what I'd, the difference was. I'm pretty sure the second one was a satyr, because he had horns. Is, how, that, is that how you know? No. We, we must look it up, really. Yeah, we must. Do you know what? I'll put a caption on the screen. We saw two statues. One might have been a fawn and one might have been a satyr, or both, mm -hmm. both of them perhaps might have been one or the mm -hmm. other, depending on how you define them. Sometimes we act like a fool Not aware we're troublemakers Sometimes we I'm the biggest fan of those overly uh, painted or shaped gardens, bushes. I prefer more natural. Yeah. For a minute, stop and breathe for a minute. Don't get over your head, try to listen instead. There was a little kissing seat, a kissing bench, and then we sat down and might have had a little kiss. And then we walked over the top of the tunnel and round the corner. And then we went to the 
small walled garden where the woman was reading a book with lots of uh, busts, the statues of some famous figures. At least we recognized two of them. There was Lord Byron's statue on bust and D.H. Lawrence. Well, D.H. Lawrence lived just down the road from me. Oh, yeah. You can visit his house. After that, we went to the Rose Garden, which to me looked more like a French garden because it was so ge geometrical and formal. manipulated and yes, exactly, very formal. And there were no roses. Artificial, yeah, exactly. <laughs> We went to the Japanese garden, which I thought looked really nice. Yeah, we didn't get to explore the Japanese garden fully mm -hmm. um, because we kind of we, we went around one corner of it and then emerged onto the main lake, didn't mm -hmm. we? And and that's where we sat for quite a long time. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. And and you did some drawing, which was I got some nice shots of you mm -hmm. as well, and also lots of lots of you roll of children, and it got quite busy there. Mm -hmm. there, there yeah. Lots of there was a lot of foot traffic along the lake. And it, I don't think that's at all surprising given it was a very beautiful location. And gorgeous day as well. Mm -hmm, yeah. Gorgeous sunshine all the way. And of course we should probably mention the swans and the ducks. Mm -hmm, yeah, very, very friendly ducks and swans. And then after we left the lake we went back and did another little circuit of the mm -hmm. uh, Japanese yes, garden. Yes, Japanese garden, yeah, and then you, you, you looked at the waterfall and then we found the tree. Yeah. And then circled around the lake. That's right. To the and we walked area. all the way back around the lake to the main mm -hmm. building and then back to the van. Mm. And you started getting very worried about my walking, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You looked exhausted. I was exhausted, mm -hmm. so I was moving very slowly, wasn't I? Not too slowly. I was huffing and puffing and sweating and probably complaining. Did I have any tantrums at all? I don't remember any no. tantrums. No. Well, that's something at least. Mm. So that was our trip to Newstead Abbey. It was a lovely day, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. We really had we a good time. Yes. And we didn't need to go anywhere else. That mm -hmm. was That was a perfect day out. Mm -hmm. And we could easily have spent longer as well. Mm -hmm. We could have explored the Japanese gardens more fully. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, and there's all the p part at the bottom of the map that we didn't look at as well. Yeah. And the, the other lake where your thumb is. Mm -hmm. All that stuff we didn't look at. Yeah. But the and, and we never went inside. And we the never went building. inside. Yeah. But the beauty of Newstead Abbey is it's so close to where we live that we can easily go back there mm -hmm. and revisit it. Yeah. And. That's that's going to probably be... Blah. 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 So that's going to be... <laughs> that's going to be where we wrap this one up, I think. Yes. Yes. So, thank you very much for watching. Uh, we hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, share, comment. Do, do all the good stuff. Do all the good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll see you next time. See you later. See you later.